Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Thursday's Daily Financial Digest. And here's what's making the headlines in the markets today. US consumer prices increased less than expected in April, suggesting that inflation resumed its downward trend at the start of the second quarter in a boost to financial market expectations for a September interest rate cut. Cryptocurrency markets saw a 5.5% increase in total capitalization following the release of inflation and retail sales data from the United States. However, Ether failed to fully capitalize on this bullish momentum. Ether has underperformed the leading cryptocurrency Bitcoin by 22% since the start of 2024. The dollar slumped against major currencies after US consumer prices in April showed inflation had resumed trending lower in the second quarter raising hopes the Federal Reserve can deliver an interest rate cut as early as September. The last session saw the euro rise 0.6% against the dollar. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal. The oil dollar pair rose 0.4% in the last session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a positive signal. The gold dollar pair skyrocketed 1.2% in the last session. According to the CCI, we are in an overbought market. The dollar yen pair plummeted 1% in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The US industrial production will be released at 1315 GMT. Australia's employment change at 130 GMT. Japan's industrial production at 430 GMT. Italy's consumer price index will be released at 8 GMT. Australia's unemployment rate at 130 GMT. The Dutch unemployment rate at 430 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Thursday's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.